Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's tough times trying to land deals are likely to get worse as Hollywood studios tighten their belts experts have warned. With everyone trying to save money during the cost of living crisis, streaming giants like Spotify and Netflix are no different and it is estimated so-called overall deals will drop significantly next year. Get the latest royal news straight to your phone by joining our WhatsApp community. The pair had signed a huge contract with Spotify for Meghan's podcast Archetypes but this lasted just 12 episodes and it has not been renewed for another series. And the Daily Mirror reports the couple are said to have been instructed to come up with new ideas to fulfill their contract with Netflix after the hit docu-series about their life. One potential show is said to be a Great Expectations-inspired show titled Bad Manners, with the program based on Charles Dickens' character Miss Havisham. If it gets the go-ahead, the prequel will change her role so instead of being a lonely spinster Miss Havisham is a strong woman who is living in a patriarchal society. YouTube's former global head of original content says Meghan and Harry's struggles to land new deals are said to be showing the state of Hollywood. Suzanne Daniels, who now teaches at the University of California in Los Angeles, says she anticipates the struggles are only going to get worse for some of the biggest names in Hollywood next year. She told the LA Times, I do think these deals are going to be fewer and farther apart because there's a lot of belt tightening right now. Meghan Markle's Suits co-star terrified after being robbed at gunpoint, latest, Ms. Daniels estimated that new so-called overall deals will drop significantly next year. Her opinion comes after PR expert Chad Teixeira said the couple might find that brands are hesitant to create a partnership. They said, given the recent setbacks with Spotify and Dior, it is likely that Meghan will be considering her next steps carefully. Her reputation precedes her, and with her credible status, she holds the potential to partner with large brands. However, these recent snubs may create hesitation among potential partners. It is important that her next move be strategic and aligned with her core values and personal brand, which will not only help her navigate potential partnerships but also resonate with her audience. Don't miss! Here's Morgan mocks Meghan Markle as he secures top TV award, watch, Harry and Meghan hire former reality star and instamom for next career move, revealed, Meghan Markle is every broadcaster's worst nightmare says expert, opinion, but the Duke and Duchess careers are currently far from in jeopardy because, as well as the multi-million deal with Netflix, they also have the deal with Penguin Random House, the publishing house responsible for Prince Harry's autobiography. Spare. A spokesperson for Archul Productions, the couple's production firm, told The Wall Street Journal the Duchess is continuing to develop more content for the archetypes audience on another platform. The spokesperson did not disclose for which platform she was making the content.